Dear Rentals Club members, I'm now joined by Moya Rockman. Moya is the founder and chief marketing officer of Smiling House Luxury Switzerland. We'll be talking with her about great things such as tapping into demand, demand channels that you may not be using right now. For example, travel agencies, all these existing channels that you could reach, reach, reach out to. We'll be talking about the luxury vacation rental market as well. What was it like in 2020? How is it going to be like in 2021? She has a unique viewpoint, right? Her company is present in 85 destinations across 28 countries. So I'm very curious to, to hear about that. And then we'll also be talking about how you, as a vacation rental owner or property manager, could be working with Spine House. Uh, they have a whole network that's very interesting for you to, to know about. And last thing, Obviously, uh, Moya and her husband, Ira, really built this company and grew it a lot through partnerships. So what is the power of partnership? If I am a property manager, how can I grow my business from this? So these are four questions, uh, and Moya has a lot to say about this. So without further ado, Moya, hello and welcome. Hi, thank you for taking the time, and it's wonderful to be here. Uh, today with you and and, and speaking with uh, this great network of uh, property owners around the globe, just wonderful. Um, Thank you for being here. And again, you, I know you are your busy schedule. You have you know you have so much to do. You're growing this this company and traveling. So um, maybe without further ado, can you maybe tell us a bit more about you know, Smiling House? What's you what's Smiling House about? Yeah, so Smiling House, it's all about um, actually uh, the, 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 the luxury part of the vacation rental. Um, we started, our, our, our journey started with, uh, with the fact that we've been um, the host of One Chalet in the Swiss Alps and we fell in love with hospitality. That was like about 10 years ago. And since then, we slowly but surely, in the beginning as a hobby, and then uh, more and more in a professional way, start to develop uh, the, the network of uh, luxury homes in the beginning only in Switzerland and only in the Alps. And later on, uh, meeting a lot of, uh, of, of great um, hosts like ourselves around the globe and feeling that there's a huge gap and a huge need for a um, uh, channel that will represent this kind of old um, um, uh, school of uh, luxury accommodation. I'm saying uh, old school. It, it's not because I mean it's old. I just mean that this kind of vacation rental like, always and always ever and ever been there. Since the 16th century, 17th century, in all the books we can learn about people who, who travel to a vacation home in the countryside, in the mountainside, by the sea, etc. And this was much, much before the OTAs. And that's why uh, it took time for this layer of, the, um, of, of, of vacation rental to join the OTAs. And while they joined the OTAs, many of them, just like ourselves, find out that the OTA not giving the real answer for all the needs of uh, hosting the vacation rental in the luxury vacation rental. Because it's based on uh, instant booking, because it's... Um, and normally uh, for smaller amount than, uh, than uh, these houses that we are managing uh, and, and any other, many, many other pains uh, that come with it. And therefore we try uh, to, to, to answer these questions ourselves. And when we didn't find the answer, we, we, we started to, uh, to develop Smiling House as the answer. As a, and in, in, in short, uh, the, what is Smiling House? It's actually, uh, alliance of property owners and property managers all around the world um, that they have one thing in common. They are busy with hospitality and busy with accommodation that's considered to be luxurious. And you'll be surprised to see how uh, the level of, of, of luxury is the same in Bali, in St. Bart's, in Geneva, in uh, Brazil and in Jerusalem. And even in the small island of Cyprus, there is some code around the world that when somebody going to a, a luxury accommodation, he's expecting it. And it doesn't matter really the design and the view. It's normally what he, he will feel wherever he is in the world. And this is the kind, exactly the kind of partnership we're looking for. And the whole um, uh, company of Smiling House is built on partnership and it's built on on the uniqueness of uh, of the properties coming together as uh, as as a one strong 
uh, database of luxury all around the world. So one, one angle uh, which I really like about your company is that, as I said at the beginning, you enable this alliance of property managers and owners to tap into these, let's say, traditional or old school, let's say, channels that are, for example, demand from travel agencies or, or luxury services, right? So yeah. um, that's what's the one kind of demand that you are bringing. Can you maybe share a bit more about how you, you do this and how a property manager could benefit from that? Sure, sure. Um, it's for the last two, three years that we realized that even though the OTAs always say that uh, what is OTA is online travel agency, right? Uh, so the OTAs were supposed to replace all this kind of travel agents and uh, travel designers and other names that you that that you can find uh, for the people busy with that. But it's not true when it's come to luxury. When it's come to luxury and it's come to complicated kind of complicated um, um, uh, trip with a lot of people with more money involved, uh, you mainly will see and the need in in this uh, mediator this specialist who knows how to tailor made this kind of trip for their clients and now since um since covid 19 uh it's even more uh, uh, trustful because people who used to go to this kind of professional uh and see and and ask them to to find them their best hotel are now coming with a demand for a luxury home. They also want to stay in a safe, pri private, and you know, with all the amenities. So we saw this kind of professionals trying to reach out to us through the OTAs and also directly, and they really do not know how to work with our industry. They have no clue. And we decided to take on ourselves the big mission and the important mission to be the bridge between the legacy travel uh, industry, all these professionals, and from the other hand, to all the homeowners and property managers in our alliance to make sure that the request of travel designers, concierge companies, uh, all kind of mice professionals, mice is the people that are busy with weddings, people are busy with events, uh, will know how to reach out to you, the homeowner of a luxury uh, villa or chalet or mansion or whatever, uh, to, to have uh, his, um, you know, uh, uh, client happy to find them this unique solution and unique hospitality that we can deliver. And you won't believe how fascinating it is uh, since we just launched about a month ago our B2B software. It's, um, it's a software that is more than white label. It's dedicated label for the partner where all the properties of Smiling House, it's more than 3,000 properties today all around the world is exposed to him. So if you will have a client this afternoon that would like to go to St. Bart's and tomorrow he will have a demand for a next year wedding in Mykonos, he can use the same tool and offer it. So actually everyone that joining us, joining our alliance can be exposed to this channel as well. So if I, if I understand, before we talk about, about trends and amenities, because you, you were really touching on very interesting points here. So... So once again, if I'm a property manager and I, and I work with you, so what to expect? I can get my properties listed by you and I can also tap into this network maybe to recommend properties that I may not have, but recommend properties from that catalog basically to my clients. Is it, did, uh, do I get it well? Yeah, you got it well. And it's even more wide than this. When you're joining Smiling House Alliance, first of all, it's, uh, it, it's, cost, it's cost nothing. We, are, we see ourselves as, as a network of, of, of uh, professionals that like to work together and shake hands together and share. This is a sharing economy based company. And um, when you're joining Smiling House, uh, your properties will be exposed in few channels, in the B2B channel, in um, a partnership that Smiling House has, for example, with Marriott. Uh, we will be able to offer your property to Marriott um, uh, homes and villas. Uh, under our wings and with other our standards and due diligence that we did with the company and to see if it's standing the standards, it will get the rating of homes and villas. And uh, also in certain places in the OTAs uh, where we are acting on behalf and of course with Smiling House where we have a lot of demand for this kind of layer of B2C of direct clients uh, who who is seeking for this kind of solution, private, big homes, mansions, chalets, wherever in the world. And don't forget, in normal time, 
these kind of clients, they are not traveling once in a year. They normally traveling between 12 and 14 times a year to different destinations. So they're very, very open also to discover new places and new destinations. So in that, in that sense, we are welcoming uh, homeowners and property managers from all around the world. Whoever is touching uniqueness, unique properties and luxurious properties. And talking about luxury, for, for, for me, um, I always say it, uh, luxury is not only about design, it's not only about the, the, the nicest uh, furniture, etc. It's about uh, na nature as your neighbor. It's about uniqueness. It's about authenticity. And we're looking for all these unique uh, properties. And, you know, I call luxury to whatever is you won't find the same just next door or, 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 or a copy paste of it in another country where you don't know anymore where you are, like happening sometimes when you are in a very fancy hotel, but you do not know if you are in Turkey or in, in Thailand. Um, and about the forecast, you, you asked before about 2020 and 2021, we see many, many trends. Um, the first trend is you know, um, uh, we, we could work together with the, with the property managers uh, that needed help. For example, uh, property managers in, in, in Italy, uh, we, we got them together so they could refer, refer uh, clients who already could only go to Italy. And one time they wanted to, um, uh, to be in the north, but they've been already in the north. So property managers helped each other and, and, and send referrals one to another within, within the platform. That was, that was wonderful to see. And uh, we saw uh, markets that was kind of independence, like St. Bart's. That was uh, that's very familiar to you, of course. That was in huge demand. We just had crazy bookings, and and other and other markets like Dubai that was open, for example, for the Russian um, uh, um, uh, travelers and to other. So we know in Smiling House also where where guests are or where or where uh, professionals are, and we know already the rules of COVID, and we're able to offer them ideas of where to travel to, where it's regulation allow it. So, you know, we're doing, it's, it's not an instant book thing. It's a whole concierge and a lot of communication that we know we're doing on behalf of our, um, um, you know, property managers. And in the end of the day, what I like to say is that we are working together hand in hand. We're taking the two parts of hospitality. We're taking the first part of welcoming the guests, making sure that you will book. Also as a Swiss company, we got a lot of credibility and, 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 and our great partners all around the world are giving the amazing journey of their real experience on, on spot. And this way, when we imagine this kind of, of working together, this kind of hosting together, we have a lot, a lot of happy uh, guests that of course like to return once again. Uh, it's great to hear that you can make property managers in Northern Italy happy and also the guests as well. That's a smiling house promise, I guess. Uh, my, my last question here, because we've been talking, you know, how you, you know, went from property manager to building this alliance, uh, building software as well, and a lot through partnerships, right? You mentioned Marriott, for example, um, uh, and this, the alliance is a suite of partnerships, basically. So if I'm a property manager, and, and here I'm talking really to you, uh, Moya, the entrepreneur. So let's say I'm a property manager, how, how should I leverage the power of partnerships to grow my business? What's been your experience? So, yeah, I have I have a lot of a lot of tips for the property managers, even in small scale until the biggest scale. So in the small scale, wherever you are in the world, first of all, open your eyes and understand that you are now part of community. When you are part of community, that maybe in the in the in the in the close future will be depending also on the people in your country, the people speaking your language, and the people. Uh, that you used to have from abroad will not come soon. Open your mind. Look first of all about your exposure. How can people find you? Start to be active in, in groups, groups of hosts. Don't be afraid of competition. There's no competition if you're good and if your, uh, your, your product is unique. And you can make your product unique. You should work on the pictures. You should work on the description. Uh, you know, uh, uh, be out there. Discover the, the, the social media, discover LinkedIn, discover uh, Instagram, uh, even Twitter. And on the wider scale, 
of course, you know, we are mainly working with, uh, with, with big properties and, and unique properties and luxury properties. But if you, any of them, um, of course, join us and, and, and get exposed to or, or, or join other alliance of, of property managers and get more chance by being under the umbrella of others. It's not instead of what you can do alone. You should not be afraid of it. You just open to be to share your success and to share uh, the fact that other people working for your for your uh, success. And as the last thing, us as Smiling House, we uh, really, really dedicated to this kind of partnership. We're looking and this kind of partners uh, looking for us. So we are working with certain clubs like Third Home. We are working with uh, with Marriott Worldwide and we're working um, with uh, uh, all kinds of other clubs that looking for this kind of uniqueness. And we are very busy uh, in the social media, etc. So people will be able to find it if they cannot find the one that they will find at least the umbrella. And then we can uh, you know, forward it. And now with the thing with the, with the vacation rental, uh, B2B uh, software, uh, we're actually aiming even for new, for new industries that nobody thought about. We are offering our houses as location for the media uh, uh, production companies mm -hmm. and uh, for, for, for uh, layers of managers that cannot travel to hotels right now and to give them a different uh, uh, experience by trying to be together uh, in 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 a home in a home initially, uh, you have to stay back to the to the to the recommendation. You have to stay creative, you have to stay positive, and you have to look for your USP, which is unique selling proposition. Even if you, your unique selling proposition is that you're just ten minutes away from from the nearest hospital, maybe somebody needs to stay not for a vacation. Another big trend that I want you to, to keep in mind if you are in getaway destination uh, is, the, is the digital nomads. Mm -hmm. It's the remote working that creates so much uh, opportunities for us as, uh, as um, uh, people who are busy with hospitality. So don't expect to find only the one that's coming for a weekend or for a week for a vacation. Change your mindset. Maybe it's somebody just like yourself that just so much want to change his his views and want to change his his um, you know his location and just keep on working and for this kind of people we need to give a home a real functioning home with all the amenities everything that a man uh, somebody needs in order to to be uh, staying with you for a few weeks so once you're thinking about all these kind of things you will find for sure the one that's appealing more to you and if you are in the luxurious space of course we'll be happy if you join us that's, that's great advice. So Moya Rockman, you again, you're the founder CMO of Smiling House Luxury Switzerland. So if I want to reach out to you, what's the best way to uh, get a hold of you? Um, okay, so first of all, we are. I am in LinkedIn under Moya Rockman. You'll find me quite easily. And Smiling House, of course, you can find us uh, in smilinghouse.ch. And, um, and 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 uh, in Facebook and in LinkedIn, where we have almost twenty seven thousand followers, oh, we believe wow. very much in the power of uh, of, of of the look, and uh, yeah, and and I'm very very happy to be in touch with each and every one of you, also to drop some uh, tips and uh, and learn one from another. I believe that whatever I built together with my husband, this kind of business. Uh, built with the knowledge and the know-how and the passion of so many people around the world. And I'm so grateful. So I'm always uh, willing to share uh, from my side as well and be happy to be in touch. Well, thank you so much for your time today and for the tips and for the energy I think you uh, really went through, gave through this video to uh, people watching. And I hope to uh, you. meet you soon in 2021 in person. Sure, me too. All the best to everybody and see you soon.